hi welcome back to rebecca's travels so if you're watching my lifestyle channel hi welcome back to rebecca's lifestyle hi how are you all doing i hope everybody's as well as possible um the weather in the uk is actually warmed up in northwest leicestershire um it has been sunny and um dry um today so which is uh, really good um definitely different from yesterday <laughs> Um, if you haven't subscribed to my channel please subscribe to both my travel and my lifestyle channels a uh, big thumbs up and thank you for doing so um, I really appreciate it and I love talking about travel and uh, lifestyle um, today I'm going to be doing a budget travel destination special April 2024 part 2 so if you want to know more about the latest budget um, travel destinations 10 exciting facts please keep watching um, and this is from uh, buzzfeed.com where is where i'm getting the information number one on the list is poland uh, super cheap lots of history and castles and museums um, like you have in western europe and fewer tourists so um than what you do get in western europe so it's a poland's an idea um if you're looking for a cheap destination um that is not as commercialized or um just f fewer tourists in general so you won't need to wait a, a long time um to say get into attractions etc it's an ideal place to um travel to and uh, number two japan is surprisingly cheap for what you get and Number three, Portugal has a wide uh, range of pretty and affordable activities and uh, pretty beaches and affordable attractions compared to other parts of Europe. And um, so Portugal is uh, basically um one of the cheapest places in western europe to travel to number four um right now argentina is one of the best deals um in the world um imo only thing is is the flights so expensive to get there but once you have got there um most things um, are much cheaper so that's if you can um bear a long flight um and the price or and the price of the flight to get to argentina things are much cheaper and number five tanzania has a whole is great um it's like all of kenya experience like with say the beaches and say safaris um but it's um much cheaper than kenya and the countries are next door to each other and um this person was saying um, it's one third of the pro uh, the cost so if you did want to save money then Tan Tanzania is is cheaper than Kenya and and number six um, my big surprise was uh, South Africa um, an old school friend has just had a, a seven day uh, trip there and um her mum said uh Brian, um that that 
the couple really enjoyed it and um, and that place was Cape Town in South Africa such good value um, obviously depending on the currency situation obviously um, in your country as it does fluctuate a bit uh, but um, but I'd assume that you're always going to get a lot for your money um, number seven um, best Southeast Asia particularly Laos um, but the whole region is it's still great value uh, one shot over there it's probably the most expensive thing is going to be your flight to get over there and obviously the amount of time it's going to take you number eight at uh, vietnam again in uh, southeast asia it's extremely cheap and things are generally pretty good um, especially the food options and lodgings um, number nine uh, Taiwan is excellent at value the prices for everything um, are well below what you might expect so that's another uh, country uh, to think about and uh, last but not least um, if you want to travel to Europe um, but again, um, are looking for a cheap country to travel to, and um, is Albania. And um, you get the some the same coastline as Montenegro, um, but not with Montenegro's prices. So, um, if you're looking for an a cheaper alternative to Montenegro then Albania um, is a great pick and again it's a less touristy country and um, you've got um, probably f uh, fewer attractions but um, you haven't got um, like all the overcrowdedness and busyness so again um, it's going to be a lot cheaper and and it's a, a just a lot less popular and it's again it an easy way to save money and I would like to say thank you for watching and um, I, I'm going to be doing a luxury travel special tomorrow so please keep watching and I would like to say have a, a good day and night wherever you are in the world thank you and bye for now thank you bye